We already walked through a brief example of how to do a turned diameter where we are roughing in the z-axis. Let's talk a little bit about facing a part off. First of all, we're going to have to program two elements. We have to have a, two perpendicular moves following the rules of the, of the Herco programming. We have to have two perpendicular moves for our starting and our ending point. So at least two elements are going to be programmed in this particular feature. Got a two inch piece of material that I need to face some material off the front of. And I'm going to start a little bit above the diameter of the part on Z0, move down below the center of the part, removing any tit that would be left by the radius of the tool. And then I'm going to move out to a distance in front of the part. First of all, we have to program our rapid position. Again, this is a point that the tool can rapid to both before the feature is cut and after safely. And then I'll just begin to program the profile just like I would if I was turning along the z-axis, only I'm going to program my moves in the x-axis. In this, in this example, I'm starting 50 thousandths bigger than the material, and I'm starting right on z of 0. I simply program a face moving in the x-axis only to a minus 32 thousandths. That takes me past the center of the part at least the radius of the tool, again, to remove the tit that would have been left by the tool if I had stopped anywhere above zero. And then I simply turn to some value in front of the part. In this case, I went from zero to a positive 0.1, just moving the tool away from the material that I'm removing, some distance bigger than whatever it is that I'm taking off. 